Hey guys, so this week's trip is a spontaneous one. Booked yesterday, heading to Armenia. Survived the red eye flight from Dubai, just under three hours, and now checking into the Opera Suite Hotel. So, the uh, Opera Suites Hotel comes highly recommended, great reviews, very funky. So, currently in Yerevan in Armenia. About to explore the capital city and uh, pretty excited. And then uh, tomorrow, heading out of the city. This is a rooftop view of Yerevan. Kind of has a uh, grey Soviet feel to it. But uh, it's a great city so far. Went out of the sand pit. Any excuse for a bit of pork? Chili con carne soup, prepping for when I finally head to Mexico. So, still in the Cascades, and this is a beautiful area. finally make it all the way to Mother Armenia and she's like a tenth of the size you imagine when you are 500 meters below. But uh, still a pretty cool uh, iconic statue that overlooks the whole city. Cleaning a missile, not something you see every day. This is the strangest amusement park in Monument Park. It literally looks like a derelict site from the 70s. So Monument Park is without a doubt one of the most random places I've ever been. Uh, Mother Armenia was pretty cool, uh, but then you just have the Chernobyl style derelict theme park that looks like something from the 70s. But a uh, great place to come to take a few snaps. Always time for a cheeky Americano from a street cafe. So heading towards the end of day one and arrived at Republic Square one of the main central points of the city and has been recommended to me for nighttime photography shots. So time to get some local Armenian food and uh, hit it with a camera. Today, day two, uh, heading outside of the city to explore the outer areas. Want to see as much as possible. First stop is the town of Ishmatsien. Excuse my terrible Armenian. And we're now at the uh, ruins of Zvarnots, which is where the angels have the funny time.
now in the area of uh, Hoavirap and going to be heading uphill to the monastery. Uh, stunning views of the mountains and uh, also the Turkish border, so uh, pretty excited. So en route to Gerard Monastery and found a great spot for some lunch. And it's a restaurant with a great view as well. Here is the famous wishing bridge at the monastery. The idea is to uh, leave a handkerchief over there on the tree and make a wish. I have no handkerchiefs, so sometimes when traveling you have to improvise. Always carry extra socks. So last stop of the day is the Ghani temple the most important temple in Armenia and estimated to be around 2,500 years old. This coffee shop on the Cascades, absolute winner. <laughs> Finished checking out Armenia and really, really enjoyed it. Uh, the capital city of Yerevan had a little bit of a Soviet feel around it, if I'm honest, in terms of the uh, the grey coloured buildings. Uh, but then at the same time, it had a cool sort of street cafe and arty culture, uh, which was great. Uh, in terms of where to stay, um, Opera Suites Hotel, absolutely amazing. Uh, great food, uh, great rooms, great location, great price. It was pretty perfect and the staff are great too. Probably say the only disappointment in terms of Armenia as a whole, um, lack of tourists unfortunately. Not many people seem to come here to visit and also the local Armenian food wasn't great if I'm being honest. Uh, but definitely worth checking out the place.